Okay, y'all, so this is my second time recording this video because I was too zoomed in on, my, on the last video and I did not even recognize that until way after, way into the video. So, anyways, I am here. I am back after a long time, probably trying to show you guys what's all in this, what's in my bag. This is the extra, extra large Kensington bag. And if you're, if you watch my last video, because there was some copyright issues with that video. So I'm not sure if some people can't watch it, but if you were able to watch that video, you, you know where I'm going with this. You won't feel like, okay, what did you know, you'll know where I'm going with this. You won't. You have seen this bag before so this is a kensington extra extra large bag it was a bag that i got for my birthday and so i have decided to wear it and so i'm showing you guys what's in my bag so over here um on the last video when i recorded it the first time around the, the detail on this eagle was so like it was just it was popping the sun was out it was glistening and you could have pretty much tell i just love the detail on this eagle I love the detail. The eyes are black, as you can see, and then the little rhinestones they glisten when the sunlight hit, when the sunlight hits it. Um, at the top here, you guys know that the um there's two holes. Oh, there's one. We got two holes at the top. One over here. One back there. And at the top, it says Kurt Geiger, and then it says London. And then the chains come out of the holes and they have like a little padded um thing here to make to make it um comfortable to wear this bag does get heavy the more you put in there i have it stuffed to the max like i always do and um because i have to see what all can fit like i really have to see what all can fit and the more can fit the more i just be wanting to add things into it i'm just so excessive anyway so on the side here I have attached it, this little um this little bag that I got from Victoria's Secret. So I add I have added my charger, my portable chargers in here. So you'll see my iPhone charger and my um what's the there? My iPhone charger and also my Apple Watch charger is in here. And I have some feminine products in the back as well, some penny liners, I think. And then over here I have this this mask storage box it is super huge and i love it it's yellow and i have this thing going on for yellow um in this season i'm picking up everything that's yellow um yellow and white this is so cute on the inside it opens like i won't be able to actually show you guys how it opens and what's inside it's a mask in there and um because i'm doing i'm working with one hand and then on the other side of that is this little thing that i got from bath and body works but i think i'm going to I think I'm gonna change it and use. I got this other little bumblebee, this cute little bumblebee, bumblebee one that I got from um, Bath and Body Works. And I think I'm gonna change it and put that one instead. In here, I think I have strawberry um, pound cake hand sanitizer in here. And that's all on the side because there is a hook here. Something like that. How did I attach this? huh so the way i attach this is this is insane i'm trying to see how i actually even attach this on the side so hold on y'all because i'm like whoa how did you attach this okay so i'm just gonna open this up and then we'll, i'll really get into the full view of how i actually attach that thing on the side so this is how it looks when you open it up okay i see hold on now so so what I did was, huh, now that's funny, that is real life funny. Okay, so what I did was the bath and body holder, I mean, I did not realize that, but okay, so the bath and body holder, I'm thinking the bath and body work container whatever i attached it to the side of the bag itself i probably thought that i was doing it with the like with the chains or whatever um through the chains but ended up like you know and it kind of pierced the bag a little bit if you um can see but i guess i don't mind i was wondering why it's so sturdy it's been so sturdy all along and i've been able to attach all this stuff to it 
but now I see why. Okay, moving along. So I think I'll just start from the back to front because I have less things in the back. So in the back here, I have my iPad. Um, my iPad in this case is red. And then um, in the little pocket here, well, I have on the side of the iPad charger, I had this hand sanitizer. I love the smell of this. I do not regret buying this. And then in the back, in the back pocket, I have this little thing that I got from Hobby Lobby. I am able to um, use it for whatever at first. I thought I was going to be able to, I was going to be using it for a whole bunch of, I guess to add cards. But I decided to add um, some floss in here. And I got these little brush, brush. I went to Walmart to look for like a portable brush. But I got these little, um colgate thingy majingis brush like stuff things and that worked perfectly for me i'm like yo that works better than the portable brush that i was looking for i think i'll just put it back in here because ain't no point of taking all this stuff out this that i have in here i actually have to just take it out because i don't really i'm not really using it right now so i'll take it out and then back there i have a mirror that i got from sheen so I'm just gonna um I'm gonna just add my stuff back in here, y'all. Cause okay, and then in the front here, I have I guess I'll start on this side. On this side, I have my MM. No, I won't do that. I'll start over here because okay. So on this side, I have this little thing that I picked up from Target. It's a portable um I guess portable knives and forks and stuff. And I got this because um when i am out or when i'm at work or whatever and i have to um eat i don't want to use any body spoons or plastic spoons another thing that i picked up from target is this little um this little fin right here this is so cute so it has like a little ring light and then it also has the fan that is so far it's so strong so um what I like about this one is that you just put batteries in it. Some of the other ones, you have to, like, charge them. And I'm like, after a while, I lose the chargers. I have no idea what the chargers are. So, I love this one because it's just battery usage. Okay. Um. After that, I have this pencil case that I got from Dollar Tree a while ago. And I just have a whole bunch of pencils in here and a whole bunch of pens. Okay. I guess that's the best I could do. I hate doing these things with one hand. Um, And then what else do I have? In the front here, I have my Chance by Chanel perfume. I'm just trying to actually get rid of this because I have another one that was gifted to me. And it's even bigger than this bottle. And it's just sitting, sitting on my shelf. So I'm trying to get rid of this so that I am able to at least use the other one very um right next to that one i to that whatever i have a spray here that i got from target that everyone has that had went viral this finery um spray this smells exactly like the chance by chanel perfume so if you have no idea what the chance by chanel smells like and you want to um you don't want to spend all that money and you don't know if it's gonna whatever whatever you can go to target and if you can find these still get the finery flower bed um body mist it smells just like the chanel behind that no wait in front of that was this okay i just got this from walmart as as well i got this little thera breath um portable because i have the big bottle at home but this this is like a little i guess the tsa version so i got this one Cause I do be eating y'all sometimes and I'll be like, I need a floss or like whatever. I'm trying to keep these teeth intact. I paid too much money to not do so. Anyway, so back behind that, I have my No Little 15. If you're not new here, you know exactly what I keep in here. Um, It has not changed much. So on this side, I have my No Little 15 has its own, what is this, hand sanitizer from Bath & Body Works. This is the warm and warm vanilla yeah warm vanilla sugar on the inside i keep all of my this is these are all of my lipstick and lip glosses nothing is at home everything is in here i mean i have a few i guess probably at home but i keep everything on deck on me at all times so this right here is something that i got from i think what is this this is maybelline or yeah maybelline 
and this is in the color silk because i'm a nude wearing girl and then this is in the this is also maybelline in the color topaz then I have some Juvia's Place um, lipstick. What is this? In the color Nubian Nude. And then I have more lip gloss, clear lip glosses. Some by, and then I have this dark lippy that I don't like so much. Um, this is by Juvia. Also, it's called Bronze Chestnut. It's just too dark for my liking. Um, I do better with nude, um, nude finishes and this right here i have toasted almond by what l'oreal by who i mean and then i have a little clicker here that i'm supposed to use for my phone to take pictures of that. but i never do i have still yet i have yet to use this thing so let me put these things back in here it's just more lip glosses you guys it's nothing fancy and i will just zip this later um okay and then we are literally almost empty aside from my um ipad that i just put right back in here and this jar is really rose water and so i carry this because i just um i'm just starting my lock journey and my hair just be feeling so dry so as i am on the go i'm gonna do that right now as i'm on the go i just spray my hair with rose water okay and then so now we'll start from these are my glasses and here i keep my prescription glasses you already know this is like literally starting to slouch now so let me see if i can like there we go so i have my mm agenda in here and i'm not gonna do like a thorough um flip through or whatever because i do plan on making a video a more in-depth video regarding this um regarding this so this is pretty much what i would say like my sinking funds my pretty much my long-term um money goals are in here i do not keep all cash on me i do use the full cash um system you know and then just to like know where i'm at anyway so when you open it up this is how it looks this is how i have it set up i got it high stamped at louis vuitton i just got this um two months ago around my birthday as well and i do not too much like the quality of this if you can, guys can see this is all glazing i'm not sure if that is just like i don't like the quality i don't and if you um watch my birthday haul video you will know that I went through a little of a, you know, like it wasn't just like a little, a one, two thing to get this um, item. And now that I have the item, I'm like, I should have just went with Fashion File. You know what I'm saying? I should have just, because I was complaining like, you know, I don't know if I should get it through Fashion File or whatever. But anyways, I'm not too happy with the quality, but it is what it is. So, um, and then I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to go in depth with this because I plan on doing a video about it. And plus it's personal. So, okay yeah so that's the medium size agenda um by louis vuitton a lot of the planner girls call it um the mm it is not the mm if you're gonna go online and look for it it's gonna you have to put in medium size medium size agenda and that's how it would pop up okay speaking of which i then have my pm well it's not pm this is a small ring agenda the girls call it the pm but it's not pm if, if you're looking for it online you have to put in small ring small ring agenda to find it um in the front here's a little audio block clip that i got from etsy and this is kind of like my wallet aside from my wallet so oh money falling out so what what i would do is i just pretty much budget in here and then let's say like um i gave myself 60 bucks for gas right so let's say i go in here i need to put gas i would take 30 dollars for that week or whatever and then put it in my actual wallet which is attached to this little keychain here youtube girls made me do it i got this little keychain from victoria's secret i got this little um sunflower case from sheen and um this is my spending card so i i literally would just i'll go crazy and spend whatever money i i want to spend on that card ridiculous so um 
as you open it this is how it looks and um this i got this little thing from etsy right here and then i got this right here from pinterest it was like a little thing that i i pretty much screenshot it and then i um i used print to size to size it laminated it and at um staples yeah in the back there i do have my passport and so I'm going to put this money back in here. I think it was just laying like this. This is like probably. This is probably change from something that I just purchased. Okay. Then I do have in the front here my card holder that I just got from Lupton as well. In here is a bank card. Um, This is this is card that I do not reach for that often. So I will house um, everything that I do not reach for I also have do I have my credit card in here? I think it's not. I think that's in my my small agenda. And so yeah, so this is a card holder I got from Louis Vuitton for my birthday. I in reverse monogram print. Um I do I don't know, I love this. It was only 250 bucks. So I don't care. I do I mean I do care, but I don't care as much. My feelings are not hurt as much of, with the quality. The quality is also not the best there was some glazing that was happening but i guess i don't see the glazing anymore but as you can see there's like little flyaway thread here and there it's just not what i would ex you know expect from louis vuitton yeah so with that being said i have gotten to the bottom of this bag this is all that i have in here this bag is so cute it's so huge and it's so spacious it does elevate your wardrobe it just it just has a rich B, rich B energy. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, thank you for coming to my video. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Um, like, subscribe, comment, and share. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye.